Does your furry friend take over your bed every night? It's time to reclaim your space while giving them the comfort they deserve with the coldest, cozy dog bed. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description to buy now on Amazon. Jessica Biel wore a long-haired wig when on the set of her new movie The Better Sister in New York City on Friday. The 42-year-old had long honey blonde locks that were styled into soft waves as they cascaded down her shoulders. Last month, the wife of Justin Timberlake cut her locks to a short bob. The siren also had on a white cartoon t-shirt that read made right. She added dark wash jeans and a long blue cardigan. Jessica added black slides and black sunglasses as she wrapped up filming. And she carried a shake in one hand as she crossed the street in the Big Apple. Just a day prior, the Seventh Heaven alum was photographed filming alongside co-star Elizabeth Banks on the set of the Prime Video series. Jessica wore a green tank top tucked into tan chinos and draped a navy sweater over her shoulders. Her look was accessorized with chic sunglasses, gold necklaces, and a stylish taupe purse. Meanwhile, Elizabeth sported a floral black blouse paired with black jeans and matching leather shoes. The Hunger Games actress donned a crossbody bag and kept a leather jacket draped across her arm. Per the show's official decision, The Better Sister, based on a 2019 novel by Olafair Burke, follows Chloe. Jessica, who moves through the world with her handsome lawyer husband Adam, Corey Stoll, and teenage son Ethan by her side while her estranged sister Nikki, Elizabeth, hustles to make ends meet while trying to stay clean. The synopsis continued, when Adam is brutally murdered, the prime suspect sends shockwaves through the family, laying bare long-buried secrets. Jessica serves as an executive producer, under her Iron Ocean Films label, with Elizabeth executive producing through her Brownstone Productions. Meanwhile, the Yulee's gold actress's work day comes on the heels of her husband Justin Timberlake's DWI arrest last month. Despite the sexy back artist getting arrested in Sag Harbor, New York for allegedly driving while intoxicated, the couple isn't phased. Following the scandal, a source told People that Jessica and Justin aren't focused on the legal matter and instead are spending their time working and enjoying their personal lives. They're always supportive of each other's careers, the insider told the outlet. And that continues to ring true as Jessica was spotted dancing at Justin's Forget Tomorrow World Tour stop at Madison Square Garden days later. Jess would never miss a show when she's able to attend, the source added. She's excited for him. They've moved on from the arrest, continued the insider. They have faith in their legal team and continue to focus on work and their family instead. Noting about the Candy Star's latest series, the source concluded, Jess enjoys filming and is excited about the project. These days, Jessica also has her career as an author to keep her busy. People don't talk enough about periods, she captioned an Instagram post of herself holding her new children's book. Period. So I wrote this book to change that. If we grown-ups have the confidence to tell the truth about how menstruating bodies work, then we'll give the kids around us the agency and voice to talk about their own bodies with confidence, now and for the rest of their lives, double exclamation mark. Jessica added, honored to publish this book in partnership with At A Kids Go and At Period Movement, link in bio to pre-order and learn more. Meanwhile, the lovebirds have continued gushing over one another on social media. You're so many things to so many people, Jessica wrote on Instagram for Father's Day. But to us you are the rock. The rock we climb on, we lean against. The rock that shades us from the sun. And when we recline on you, as we always do, Hopefully our butts will keep you eternally grounded and warm. We love you. In March, Justin gave his leading lady a birthday shout-out, writing, There ain't no other way to say it. You're the best. I love you. Happy birthday, yeah. The NSYNC member was arrested on June 18 following a night out with friends at the Hamptons Hotspot, the American Hotel. After leaving the establishment, Justin was pulled over while on his way to a friend's house. He was charged with one count of DWI and was given two citations, the first for running a stop sign and another for failure to keep in lane. Justin is due back in court on July 26, but he took a moment to thank the audience for their support throughout.